Hello everyone! Good evening sa inyo lahat! So, nandito na naman ako. This is Mommy Ria for some insights from the Bible. So, I decided to tackle now things about the feelings of worn out, pagod. Men experience tiredness and pagod because of hectic work, jobs, and chores, and heavy load everyone bears due to many tiring things in this life. So, especially now, all these millennium, millenniums are so workaholic, so energy, talagang nakaka-tired yung mga ginagawa nila. So, creations of God became worn out and don't know what to do to make solutions for this. So, the Bible has some points on this topic. So, according to Matthew 11, 28-30, it says, Come to me, all you who are weary and heavy burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you, and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy, and my burden is light. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. So, in Tagalog, mababasa natin sa Biblia, sabi dito sa Mateo, 11 verses 28-30. Lumapit kayo sa akin, kayong lahat na nabibigatan at nahihirapang lubha sa inyong mga pasanin at kayo'y bibigyan ko ng kapahingahan. Pasanin ninyo ang aking pamatok at matuto kayo sa akin sapagkat ako'y maamo at may mababang kalooban. Makakatagpo kayo sa akin ng kapahingahan sapagkat madaling dalhin ang aking pamatok at magaan ang pasaning ibibigay ko sa inyo. So, that's it. So, akala ng mga tao, it's hard to be godly people or being holy. But, it's so worth it. And, we deserve happiness and joy pag naging righteous persons tayo according to the Bible, according to God. So, mababasa naman natin sa 2 Corinthians 4, verse 16 to 18. Sabi dito, Therefore, we do not lose heart, though outwardly we are wasting away. Yon tayo, tayo mga righteous people. Yet, inwardly we are being renewed day by day. For our light and momentary troubles are achieving for us an eternal glory that far outweighs them all. So we fix our eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen. For what is seen is temporary, but what is seen is eternal. So, in Tagalog, sa pangala- pangalawang korinto, Chapter 4, verse 16 to 18 sa Tagalog. Tayo yung mga taong nabubuhay sa pananampalataya sa Diyos. Kaya't hindi kami nasisiraan ng loob. Correct. Kahit na humihina ang aming katawang lupa, patuloy namang pinalalakas ang aming espiritu araw-araw. Ang bahagya at panandali ang kapighati ang dinaranas namin ngayon ay magbubunga ng kagalakang walang hanggan at walang katulad. Kaya ang paningin namin ay nakatuon sa mga bagay na di nakikita at hindi sa mga bagay na nakikita. Sapagkat panandalian lamang ang mga bagay na nakikita ngunit walang hanggan ang mga bagay na di nakikita. So, Meron nga ang kanta, uh, Blessings by Laura Story. It, it says something like this in the bridge. Sa tulay nung kanta. When friends betray us, 
When darkness seems to win, we know this pain reminds this heart that this is not, this is not our home. It's not our home. Because, you know, ano sa nambahay natin? Sa heaven, with God. Heaven is our home. Someday. What a joy we may feel if we're already there with our God, our Creator, and our loved ones. Hallelujah! Yon, yun ang masarap. And don't worry kung nahihirapan tayo dito. Pwede tayo magpahinga sa Diyos. Para tayo makinig ng music ng songs from God. Good music, good people, good places. Yon, that's it. So, Kung meron tayong problema ngayon or something na nagbabother us, try natin mag-pray. Yan. Huwag natin hintayin yung sagot. Ramdamin natin kung ano yung pakiramdam nung nagpe-pray sa ating Diyos. Kung gano'ng kasarap yun. Tapos sasagot na siya. Mas masarap yun. Yan. Di ba? So, yun. Makikita natin yun as we go along the way. Yan. Sa mga susunod pang mga araw. So, okay? Okay ba, guys? So, that's it for tonight. This is Mommy Ria Palma Rogas. Just click, like, share, and subscribe if you want to to watch my videos on my YouTube blog. So, that's it. So, better see you next time. And, bye everyone and good Evening, morning na pala. So, it's 12 o'clock. So, time to have a break. Rest for from the whole day work. And, sana makatagpo tayo ng kapahingahan. Hallelujah. Sa Diyos. Yun. So, that's it guys. Bye for now. See you next time. Bye-bye.